yeah. Hey guys, this is Gary Revolution, and welcome to a special kind of video. Today we are looking at the uh, new mod pack that is recently being released on the Technic Launcher. It is called Farm Life. It is actually being put together by my good friend uh, Pizza Slice or, or Gocky, whatever you want to call it. So uh, yeah, make sure you go download this pack to uh, get more information than I can tell. But uh, just to let you know, I'm not a very good expert with mods, and my skin is gone right now for some reason. And uh, I'm not an expert with mods and stuff, and so a lot of these mods, I don't know exactly what they do, but I'm just going to tell you a little bit of this mod and about this mod and some of the main mods that are in here, and uh, if you want to know a full list of mods, they, there will be a full list of mods in the description below, and also a link to download this uh, mod pack on the Technic Launcher. So, uh, yeah, uh, hopefully you enjoy the video, but first let's get straight into it and you can go away. So, uh, the first like mod in here that we're gonna look at is the inventory pets mod. We've already seen uh, two of them. One of them is the banana pet. So you just saw them just before. You can uh, like throw them and stuff and they do damage so you can kill them, kill things with it, and collect their XP. And they're really cool because like, they spin around. Let's watch it. There we go. They spin around and also you got this dubstep pet uh, which the heck is that? The amount of time I try to record this. What is that though? That just kind of scared me, and then that blood moon, this rising thing popped up. Yeah. Alright, I don't like this. So I time set date it. Alright, so, uh, yeah, and also there, I'll actually show you, I'll um, actually show you inside the chest here. Yeah. You got also this really cool one, which is the jukebox one. You right click it, and it plays whatever note is, uh, thing is in your. Well, disc is in your inventory, so you play that, and it plays far. You right click it to turn it off. And if it's going and you want to shift and right click, that changes the track to the next one. So, yeah, that's cool. And uh, you can get a bunch of uh, different ones here. So, like, you got like this creeper one. Actually, I've drawn when my recordings doing this before. I uh, actually might have it, but yeah, oh no, I don't. But uh, yeah, I did it. You can tell I did it over here, just before. Like, bam. Yeah, like uh, yeah, there's different pets for like all the, like the different mobs and stuff. And it's, like you got a cool little ones in here. That I don't know exactly what they do, but they do things. And uh, actually, I actually put this uh, all in here. So the next one is farming items. I'm actually I actually think this mod's called like advanced farming or something like that, or farming advanced or something. But uh, this is a really cool mod. It has like all the, this is called farmer life this mod pack so you got like all your different like kind of a few seeds in here like there's more I'm not showing you everything that's in this mod but there's only like a selected things that I've chosen that's on each of these mods so you got like some uh, seeds and you got like some watering cans and lavering cans and different foods and stuff some goat milk and also a tractor with all these different things here and uh, yeah, you can actually equip them by, uh, actually did I equip it onto this one? Yeah, you did, I did. But what you do is you grab like the thing that you want to equip onto the back of it. Let's say you want to equip a, a mower. You go to the back of this and you shift and right click and it should pop up that uh, we've actually got the plow on at the moment, which uh, yeah, and I'll be showing you in just a sec. And you also need to uh, fuel this thing so you get you some coal or something. And then you shift and right click somewhere to fill up the coal, and by the looks of it, the max is 30. Oh no, it's not. But uh, yeah, once you've done that, you can jump on it and uh, go on F5 if you want to, and you can start just running around and plowing uh, wherever you go. It's pretty cool. And uh, I don't know how long each fuel lasts for, so yeah, don't ask me on that, but uh, go to see out for yourself and you can find out. And this uh, actually looks pretty cool, and I've got these like really awesome glasses on and stuff too, so yeah. Uh, that's that. My sister is screaming right now, so I'm sorry if you can hear that. And also, uh, the next uh, mod in here is the Magical Crops mod. So, this is more like far uh, sort of like the farming items or whatever it's, that mod's called. But, except, uh, sorry, I stretched there. But, except, it's got like uh, 
more fantasy kind of thing. So you got like different kinds of seeds here. So let's take these experience seeds and like plant a few of them down. So yeah, once they must grow, they must give you like the experience plant or something. And it's also got like its own like few armor and stuff. I'm actually wearing one of the chest plates right now. And you also got these essence. I have no idea what they do, but uh, if you want to go find out what they are, do. Uh, you can, yeah, you can go uh, find that out. So it's actually equip all this here. Yeah, sorry about that. So it actually gives you jump boost this uh, specific uh, suit. So again, yeah, you got like these cool swords and stuff. So actually, let me take that off. I put my awesome, my awesome glasses back on. And uh, so, yeah, put that back in here. Yeah. And it's weird, the tractor takes up like more than a uh, whole space in the inventory. So, the next one is uh, Mr. Crayfish's uh, furniture mod. If you've been, if you've ever played a lot of like modded and stuff, uh, you've probably run into this mod before. It's just got a bunch of furniture and uh, different things that Minecraft doesn't have to make it more realistic. You've got baths and toilets and you can place them down, fill it with water and stuff, and you've got toilets. The toilets are really cool, you can actually sit on them. And it says there, press F for fart, so you can go like this. So yeah, that's, that's kind of weird, but yeah, that, that happens. And uh, you've also got like uh, technical stuff here, like you've got stereo, actually doesn't work. Sorry guys, my dad just walked in. But it looks like if you do this and you right click it, it changes the song of all the different songs that are in like Minecraft and all the discs and stuff. So that's pretty cool. Can that like go away? There we go. And uh, so yeah, that's that. And I actually don't know what the computer does, but actually I'm interested to know. Oh yeah, you got like, you can buy stuff. Yeah, actually, yeah I couldn't remember what that did. Um, yeah, I blew up like this whole area before accidentally with that creeper thing. So yeah, that's that one. And uh, the next one uh, we're going on to is the Harvest Craft mod. Uh, actually, it has three little sections. There's the miscellaneous section here, uh, the uh, crops mod, and the food one. So uh, the miscellaneous one has like bees and honey and jelly and all this kind of stuff that's here. And it has different colored candles and stuff that probably work like uh, torches, but uh, different colors and stuff. The next one is uh, Harvest Craft crops. You got like your different berries and some more seeds and some more like you got some trees and stuff and they also give you these foods corresponding with each kind of one. And also the food, it's oh, you should see how big the food section is. It's got like a heap of food, like isn't like whatever you can think of is pretty much there. Actually let me go to where uh, here it is. Look at all this food. You're never gonna run out of food if you have at least one of them. Look, Sunday roast, barbecue, pulled pork, pork, you got your pumpkin cheesecakes, you got your fried onions, you've even got like turtles and stuff, <laughs> it's kind of weird, but uh, yeah. And also, next thing you, uh, next mod you got is the Transformers mod. I am not like the biggest Transformer fan ever, but this is like the coolest mod I hardly know anything about, like, Transformers and stuff, but watch this. Are you ready? So, I'm, I'm... Uh, guessing that Subwoof is a transformer, but you put this on. And uh, you look at me. Look at that. Actually, let me take that. Look at that. That looks so awesome. And uh, can you place this down? Oh, wow. Okay, so I just changed into. Oh, it's like that, their vehicle. Okay, I get that now. So you right click that there. Oh, makes so much sense. So let's say you have this one here. My sister's singing Let It Go. You can probably hear that. She's yelling it at the top of her lungs. So again, you click right click this. So let's say, it's like you're pretending. Give me a sec. Alyssa, can you please be quiet? Thank you. Alright, so you right click this a few times maybe. I don't know. And it like gives you like the armor and stuff and puts it on. It's like oh my gosh, they're so it looks so weird when flying. That is so cool. And uh yeah, so the next mod is the chisel blocks mod. Uh like 
This is a crazy mod where it has uh, three sections here. Let me show you them. It's good. well, you can say like five sections. Or oh, yeah, five sections. So you got the chiseled arms, which is like hardly anything. You got like your chisels and stuff in here. And then you got your stone chisels. So you got like all these different like chisel of like different kind of blocks that are already in Minecraft. And also yeah, so you got like the sandstone with like different patterns and stuff on it. Even though sandstone already has different. And you also got all your wood ones here, all your metal ones too, which are like ones that aren't really in Minecraft, but they're really cool. And that's where I got that Futura block from, from over there. And I said, day. There we go, that's better. And Ender IO is the next one. This brings in like dark tools and stuff. And uh, it's got like a bunch of different generators and all that kind of stuff in there. I don't really know what any of this stuff does because I'm not like, as I said, Oh my gosh, crouching looks so cool. <laughs> but uh, yeah, and also you got the Food Plus mod, which is also like the other food mod that I showed you, the Hubscraft foods. But um, this is more like a, like more like different kind of foods. Like it, it, I don't know what to say. That has a lot of foods, the Hubscraft. But this one's also got a lot of foods too. So this has got like your know, junk foods and stuff like. Even got slurpees and even coffees, and even like. Uh, let me show you two. Uh, food Plus, look at that. There, yeah, that's still a lot of food, too. Oh, it looks like it even has like candy armor. You got your chocolates here, too. Nice. And uh, the last, like, main mod I'm gonna look at today uh, is the Tinker's Construct mod. Uh, if you've played mod packs before, you've probably run into this before. Uh, it's got like different tools, and here, let me actually, the best way to show you it is probably to actually go to it. So, you've got like all your different tools and stuff here. That's a lot of tools, and all the parts to make the tools. And this has got like all the different blocks, and also some different workbenches and stuff to help you make all the different tools. I'm not great at this, but uh, crafting station, that's like. It's exactly like the crafting table, but, also, but I don't know how that works, and uh, yeah, that's also really cool. And you've also got like these different things here. I'm actually going to show you the goggles because they're actually pretty cool. So you put them on, and it zooms in for you. It's pretty much like an a, a Optifine zoom without Optifine. Even though this um, one pack does have Optifine, so you can double zoom in pretty much. Like look how close that gets, and press G. Oh wait, I have that set as Alt now. Okay, it zooms in now for you. And there, my Z is my zoom. For you, yeah, there's, you might have, when you first load up this mod pack, you're gonna have to change a uh, a lot of like the controls and stuff because a lot of them are already like taken and stuff, so you're gonna have to redo them. But let me put this head back on. And uh, yeah, I've just got a few other things I wanted to show you here. So you got your uh, you got a few different mobs that you can spawn out and stuff. Let's actually go over here so they're not in my way. And this is where I did it before in my past attempts. So you can actually spawn in straight away snow golems and uh, and also iron golems. So you spawn them in straight away. And you've also got these blockling things here. I didn't spawn that guy in, but they like to spawn in like plain area, plain biomes and stuff by the looks of it. So you can actually spawn these in. And then you also got your globs, which are like brown slimes and go! Go iron golem, poor snow golem died. Okay. And uh, then you've also got like these pixies, these are really cool. You can, they, they got like cool sounds too. And uh, you also got your blue slimes here too. And uh, yeah, you also got a few other ones, just type in spawn in search and you got like a heap of them here. Like, you've even got like wasp and stuff actually. Yeah, wasp are like really cool, you should listen to the sounds, kind of scary. Yeah, but my headset's got surround sound, so it kind of sounds like it's there. And oh, they look like they drop mud balls when you kill them. That's my little thing over there. And uh, this is on, like it's got like campfires and stuff. This is just an example of one of the cool little blocks and stuff. It's also got lucky blocks and stuff, so uh, you can do some lucky blocking if you really want to. And uh, yeah, you have to be in some old broken. I just remembered. But uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Make sure you download this mod pack if you did enjoy it and uh, you want to find out more. 
Uh, any questions, uh, ask me, and I'll pass them on to Pizza Slicer, and uh, I'll tell you the answer once he gets an answer for them. And also, if you've got any questions you want to ask him instead of asking me, just go straight to the uh, to the Farmer Life page thing, download on uh, on the Technic Launcher, and uh, there's a discussion page there, and he will happily answer all your questions. He tries to reply to as many as he can, but, but well, at the moment, because it's a small mod pack, he can reply to pretty much all of them. So yeah. Uh, make sure you uh, you can go download it and uh, find anything else out that you wanted to and uh, yeah I will be starting a new series soon with Pizza Slicer also on this mod pack so stay tuned for that and you'll see me learn a lot more about this mod pack and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.